Hey, um, back was good. If you don't know, it's Vic Mariani. You hear me? Daily vlogs coming. Vlogmas 2018. Litmus, all that good shit. We back with another motherfucking video. Video, you feel me? Um, this is gonna be part two to it's Friday, you feel me? It's Friday, bitches, and I'm blessed, never stressed. Check my pocket, steady checks. Get this here or be next. Cause when I come through, I'm gonna flex. Oh, oh, oh shit. with the bars, y'all didn't even know I could rap this. Let me do something about these lips, because I don't like that shit. I ain't feeling it. White, crusty, dust-ass lips. I ain't feeling it. Yeah, let me get a little Vaseline on that. But, um, yeah, man, it's Friday. I made it through my work shift. Smooth as could be. It went by as a breeze. And I'm chilling. I'm chilling, chilling. So since it's Friday, you already know what the fuck about to go down. We have something a little different today. We have a little darker, a little chocolater, a little, uh, uh, I like to call it brown, you feel me? We fucking with that Hindu today, you feel me? Little bottle, personal. Now, do not sit up here and flex now. Don't sit up here and jump, and don't sit up here and judge. Yes, I did get the goddamn little bit of the, the baby bottle of the Hindu. And you know why? Because, bitch, I wanted to. You feel me? I got plenty of motherfucking bread to go buy a couple of them big $100 bottles. But am I going to do that? Am I going to buy a $40 bottle? No, I'm not. I don't need a whole bottle. This is all I need. You feel me? This is all I need. You hear me? I don't even know. I may not even take a shot of that. It just depends on how I feel. But... To break the motherfucking iceberg, I got a little something special for y'all. This just to break the iceberg, you feel me? So, what I had last week. Oh, last week I had Budweiser. This week I got a Budweiser too. A small one. I promise you, this is like, this is like some, I ain't gonna even say no redneck shit. But, but this some baby bottle shit. I know I just not waste beer on my vest. That's okay. I got to wash it anyway. But yeah, we popped over the Budweiser. Now we finna have a wiser conversation. <laughs> I'm trying too hard at this point. But anyways, fuck it. I'm just being myself. That's one thing I want to address, bro. Be yourself, man. Be yourself. You, you can fake the funk for a period of time until the real you is exposed. And that's when really people really fall the fuck out. You know what I'm saying? Where you fake the funk, bro. You fake you fake being who you are. But once you show your real side or you, once you be yourself, nine times out of ten, a few people you was being fake to gonna fall off or fall back. You know what I mean? But as long as you be yourself, it is what it is. You can't please everybody. And everybody ain't your motherfucking round. Everybody ain't your friend. You get what I'm saying? With that being said, just keep that in mind. You know, and observe motherfuckers that you call your friends or associates. You feel me? Oh, my gosh. Look at that gauge. It's just shining on you. Y'all ain't even, y'all ain't even said shit about my new gauges, bro. Them hoes shining. Shine bright like a diamond. You check you you checking out the sauce, right? We got the rose gold in the ear. Rose gold in the nose. Rose gold on the no, I'm just <laughs> Hey, that'd be funny as fuck if I had a rose gold goddamn cap. Like shit, like bitch, you in your mid twenties. What you doing with caps on your teeth? But on, I swear I used to hate I used to hate on all my classmates who had the silver caps in their mouth. Bruh, I used to be so mad, bruh. Well my little nephew, he had two silver caps in his front in the front i was jealous as fuck like nigga was nigga was goddamn flossed out you hear me he was flossed out and i was hanging on his young ass well let's talk about this budweiser here to all my beer lovers 
kudos to you. We ain't clapping. We kudos to you. Only reason why, no, this is what I'm going to say. I was one of those people where I was like, man, fuck beer. Hell no, nah, I ain't finna drink no beer because that shit was nasty. I'm smoking drunk beer when I was younger, and it was fucking disgusting. It tastes the same now, but what I did learn is I'm at a party or whatever the fuck. I, don't, I can't even remember. Can I recall? When was this? I was at a party, and I was hella young. I was like either 19 or 20. I was at a party at this cougar house. I was kind of, you could say I was kind of talking to an older chick. She was old as hell. But I was talking to an older chick, and I'm like 19, bro. So I'm at her crib cooling. It's a party going on. People in and out, food, music, cards, ganja, everything, right? So I guess it was a, a bring your own, BYB, wait, BYOB bring your own ball the type of vibes but they supply like hunch punch beer and shit like that so when i get there i'm looking like damn this all the liquor they got and then it was like the cheapest fucking like the cheapest biggest bottle of like everclear or some shit it was just some weird shit going on and i was like hell no nah, i'm not gonna drink that cheap shit because one thing about it don't get me wrong i got this hennessy hennessy is not an expensive liquor but it's also not a cheap liquor a forty dollar bottle of Hennessy that's seven hundred fifty milliliters. You could buy a goddamn uh uh the same bottle with the same amount of liquor, Paul my son, and that shit will be like goddamn thirteen, fourteen dollars. You feel me? It tastes different. It's made different. It has different ingredients. It's brown. One is a brandy and one is a cognac. Like it's different. You know what I'm saying? So that's how I I always knew that as when I was young as fuck, even before I turned 21, like, I just knew that cheap liquor gonna get your ass fucked up way quicker than that motherfucking, that, that, that top shelf shit, you know, and as me being a bartender, I learned more about that too, so back to the, back to the, uh, 19 year old me, so I'm sitting there, bro, we smoking, playing cards, chilling, we like, yada, yada, so next thing you know, I'm like, man, fuck this. I want to drink on something, too. I want to drive and I roll with somebody. I was like, okay, I can get a little shit faced. And I ain't, you know, I ain't got too much to do right now. So I was like, all right, cool. Pop open the cooler. I look in that bitch. All I see is goddamn Bud Light, Budweiser, Corona. So I'm like, bro, they got beer in this bitch. I'm like, cool. All right, cool. So. I ain't get one. <laughs> I didn't get one. I was just like, cool, they got beer. That's all right. Got me some hunch punch. The little cougar, she was like, Zeke, you ain't gonna get no beer? And I was like, no, nah, I'm good on it. She was like, go here. I opened it. I mean, got it out the cooler for me. Boom. Popped that shit on the table. So I ain't finna be no pussy. You hear me? So I'm like, mm, give me that shit, G. Wow. Pop that bitch open. I'm sitting up here like this. The same face I made before I even start telling this story. I swear to God. I'm like, hell no, nah, this shit nasty as fuck. And I was like, bruh, I'm trying to I'm trying to think about how the people was down in them bitches on spring break and shit. Cause on God, they'll get a key or something. Pop, pop a hole at the bottom, turn that bitch upside down and drink that bitch like go, go. I'm like, hell no. Nah. That should have made me throw up. I try to do it and now I'ma screw the fuck up. But anyway, so I'm like, all right, bro, it ain't no liquor. And my cousin was like, go on and drink this shit, cool. You know what I feel? I mean, what, what I was trying to say? You know what I feel me? Was I trying to say, you know what I'm saying? But I end up mixing, you feel me in it with it? You know what I feel me? Okay, that might be the new logo. I mean, that might be the new little, the little word right there. You know what I feel me? That shit's not retarded as <laughs> fuck. Oh, okay. Anywho, I'm leaving all this in here, bro, like. Shit, this is how I am. Like, I stay mixing up my motherfucking words. Is that called Delixi? Delix? I don't know. Anyways, any fucking ways, back to the story at hand. I'm sitting up there drinking this shit. No lie. I done drunk about this much of the beer. And it's like an hour that went by. I don't feel the shit. I'm like, bro, whatever. And no lie. When I first started drinking beer, Beer was nasty to me, cold. I had to let it kind of get a little, a little nuke 
a little, I ain't gonna say nuke warm, but I had to let it nuke a little bit, you know what I'm saying? And once it nuked, then I could, you know, drink it more. Like, I can take gulps like this. Me doing that, I'm halfway in the, in the beer now, you feel me? So that's how I kind of, that's how I kind of like baby my way in. But no lie, I baby that motherfucking beer one beer i baby that bitch for like almost two hours so when i finally finished it i was like okay this ain't that bad and i did i had a little head buzz like i wasn't drunk or nothing but i had a little tipsy buzz so i was like okay cool fuck it i'm finna get another one and i'm finna try to drink this bitch the same way i'm finna try to gulp that shit down you feel me and also they was joning on me they was all like Damn, that's the same beer I gave you the first time. Mind you, they like on their third or fourth beer, bruh. So I'm like, hell no, nah, I gotta I gotta catch up. I ain't finna be no little pussy out here, you feel me? I'm already I'm probably like the youngest one in this bitch. Then I'm trying to impress this older hoe. So I was like, fuck it, bruh. When they got me another one, wow, popped that bitch open and goddamn I started drinking that bitch. Go, 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 go. Sit for a minute. <laughs> Throw a little hands of cards. Tell me about four more goats like that. Cool. Pass it on off, you feel me? They say, you know, I done drunk two beers. I'm feeling good in that motherfucker. Like, I'm happy and shit. Smiling. I'm lit, right? The bad thing. I had pissed like a motherfucker you feel me i'm in this bitch pc i'm pc by it now uh let me go use your bathroom boom it's cool if i use your bathroom to my in and out this lady bathroom like this to the fact when my cousin's like come on bro let's go because you all up in need for a bathroom i'm using the bathroom so much that shit if i wasn't at the table they already knew where the fuck i was at oh <coughs> she in the bathroom excuse me Oh, she in the bathroom. She, I'm just like, damn, y'all know my every move right now. But hell yeah, like, and ever since then, I was just like, fuck it. Why go spend goddamn $15 on a bottle and I can go spend $8 on a goddamn six pack of beer or 12 pack of beer and get drunk as hell. You know what I mean? Because you can get drunk. I've got very fucking drunk off of what i had i think i had a 12 pack i had a 12 pack of these bro drunk as fuck and i drunk about six so i drunk half of them i drunk six of them beers probably within four hours and i was drunk and then i started drinking liquor on top of that but i'm not gonna tell that full story that's gonna be later on i'm you know what i might end up telling that story today depending on um depending on how everything processes through the day i got a lot of shit to get done today um i'm just praying to god that everything goes my way like the way i vision this shit going is do this do that boom a few hours to chill back on this boom back at the crib chill mode you feel me so hopefully around eight o'clock i'll be back on eight o'clock tonight i'm not going to sleep i just got off work at motherfucker 6 a.m I just pulled up at the crib. I don't know what time it is, but it's like, what, 6, 30, 40 or some shit like that? Pulled up. Hey, I'm chilling. Go shower. Grub. Get on this Xbox, you feel me? And I'm chilling. I, I got I to gotta stay up to handle this business because I need this shit to flow like that. You know what I'm saying? And this motherfucking payday. Bank account looking good good as fuck you hear me you hear me good as fuck save your fucking money save your money fuck them jays fuck them nike suits fuck them adidas suits fuck that bitch hair fuck that bitch nails save your motherfucking money only thing i spend money on no lie gas might be a drink on the weekend food that's probably once out the week if i go out to eat third thing is maintenance wise you feel me i spend money on um groceries of course um beauty shit 
all that good shit, feminine shit, smell good shit. I spend money on that, but this goes to show you, just because it's Christmas time, that don't mean you got to blow your motherfucking money. No, I'm not finna blow my money. My nephew's gonna get what I get him. My mama gonna have what I have, what I get her. My daddy gonna have what I get him. My stepmama gonna have what I get her. And my stepdaddy gonna have what I get him. Point blank, period. I might get my, I'm gonna get my sister some. No lie, I'm gonna throw my sisters in there. We making bread this year so I can look out. But guess what? My bank account still gonna stay in motherfucker one, two, three, four four digits and i'm happy about that my shit ain't never been in no four digits bruh my bank account is in four digits my nigga four digits you hear me do you hear me this checkings account we ain't even talking about savings you hear me the fuck y'all got me fucked up save your motherfucking money bruh save your bread don't let these folk trick you out your spot save your shit it's motherfucker friday payday litmus vlogmas 2018 i'm gonna be back with another motherfucking video don't forget to subscribe like comment follow me on ig follow me on snapchat i don't be doing shit bro i mean i be making little funny videos here and there you feel me but y'all fuck with your girl bro we finna run this shit up where my motherfucking 25 subscribers at you hear me where is it we've been at a standstill we look we face to face eye to eye What's going on? Show some love, I'm finna show it back. Run that shit up, bruh.